few things I'd like to point out specifically is the relationship between this accompaniment and this instrument right here. Right there, that is the fabric of Dulumba, of all the Dulumbas. The color of the fabric is right here. But if you have this, you've got some Dulumba rhythm. So in Dunumba, unique call for Dunumba to begin. That doesn't tell me what Dunumba, but it tells me some Dunumba rhythm that's going to begin now. The songban is the thing that's going to tell me. If we have no conversation beforehand, all we need to say is pasati patapa. These two go. As a matter of fact, you have the you have a different part, but it's the same part no matter what Dunumba. So these folks go because they're going to do that same thing no matter what. And then whatever the songban says. We go. That first one we did Dunumbe. We're gonna do another rhythm called Bandonje, and we will do another rhythm called Bolo Conundo, and we will do another rhythm called Taco Saba. They are all different Dunumba rhythms with different individual meanings beyond the fact that they're part of the same family of rhythms. The second rhythm we're gonna do uh, Bandonje. You know, I've tried to research about this rhythm, and all I know it has something to do with a white monkey tail. And there's a 19, uh, I think it was 1968.